first off, I'm a resident assistant in Carver Hall. This is my second year, and um, I also organize and host events on campus, off campus, and I am a political figure in the D.C. community, and I've done a lot of work with the Vince Gray campaign. Um, the leadership qualities that I have. I just believe I am somebody that is dedicated to hearing what people have to say. Uh, at the end of the day, I think this position is about making sure that the people are heard. And so I think that I would be able to do something like that well because I feel that the needs of, I'm for the needs of the people. I'm very um, easy for people to come up and talk to. I'm very fun. I'm fun to be around. I'm friendly. I like getting business done. So I think that'll all help me in this position. Um, efforts that I have made to engage the student body would be um, the resident assistant programs that I actually put on. Um, I put on at least about seven a month. And um, I engage everyone, and if they're not only specifically from my dorm, they're open to the whole university. Um, I participate in a lot of the residence uh, life events, actually plan them and organize them as well. Um, I also do a lot of things for other campuses and other schools on campus. Um, as far as like school to be, the most recent thing that I did with them, I helped them plan and organize and also did all their graphic design and promotion materials for the Harmony for Haiti. And do a lot of programs. So basically any program on campus, I say about 50% of them, I have a hand in. Uh, as I said previously, I have experience with the community service um, area of Howard and also my organization focuses on bringing people together to um, not only educate them about lupus but to also get them active in the community in order to give back to our Howard uh, surrounding community in DC. I believe that while it is necessary, I feel like um, the student body should have had a lot more say-so in the decisions that were being made. I feel like we were misrepresented, and um, I want to change that in the future. Yeah, I feel students need to have a voice with anything that's being done, a month, two month notification for something that is going to affect our Howard to come should be something that the student body, the current student body is definitely 150% involved in. I think PCAR is, uh, it, it's, it's a good thing for the university in terms of um, helping us out financially, helping us to meet budget th and things like that, but I think that it should have been done with a lot more transparency for our, our student body. Um, one initiative that I would like to work on as soon as I get in office would be the communication. Um, I feel like there is definitely a huge lack of communication at Howard University um, as far as HUSA and the student body goes. Um, I say about 50% of campus have, has never even heard of what HUSA is and do not know who their president is. And I feel like that's a really huge issue, especially when it comes with when it comes to the issue of why students aren't involved with Howard politics. And I feel like that's one of the major things. Um, so I would begin to implement communication as soon as possible. Um, I would hold programs at the beginning of each year, of each semester, explaining the importance of Howard politics and how it affects our everyday lives and how it's going to affect um, Howard University in the future. Other thing. Um, another initiative that I think is really important, among others that they're all important, but I think some of the main ones would definitely be um, the working on the Wi-Fi here, working on making sure that internet is accessible everywhere on campus, everywhere in the dorm, so that students won't have to, you know, get up at three o'clock in the morning to run to the iLab to go type a paper up that they uh, should be able to do it in their home, in their excuse me, in their room. Also, I think. Um, Another thing we have is is, is an initiative called Holitics, which is pretty much uh, student politics broken down for students. And I think that's important because in order for us to be efficient in what we do, students have to know what it is that we do and how we do it. And so in order to do that, this program, Holitics, will give students an opportunity, um, whoever is willing to come out, the opportunity to come and learn about how the school does the things that they do and how they can get involved in doing those things. And hopefully that'll be something we can implement in the beginning of the year and keep it going throughout so that if students need clarification or if they have questions or whatever it is, if something comes up and they want to know more information about it, then we'll be able to give them that.